Hi again, Des Olstrom. I'm the BBAPT president and I hope you're enjoying our readathon. I'm going to read another one of my kids and I's favorite books, The Legend of Rock, Paper, and Scissors. This is a funny one. A long ago in an ancient and distant realm in the kingdom of Backyard, there lived a warrior named Rock. Rock was the strongest in all the land, but he was sad because no one could give him a worthy challenge. Rock traveled to the mysterious forest of Over by the Tire Swing, where he met a warrior who hung on a rope holding a giant's underwear. Drop that underwear and battle me, you ridiculous wooden clip man. I will pinch you and make you cry, rock warrior. Rock versus clothespin. Rock is victorious. I think my dog wants to read with us too. Even though he had won rock, was still unsatisfied, so he journeyed on to the mysterious, myst mystical tower of Grandma's favorite apricot tree. There he was met by an old and delicious fruit. You, sir, look like a fuzzy butt. What? <laughs> I challenge you to a duel, then let us battle. versus apricot. I will beat you rock with my tart and tangy sweetness. Rock is victorious. Ugh, I was smushed. And yes, smushing you brought me no joy. Are you not entertained? You were entertained, but the battle had been too easy so Rock left the kingdom of Backyard, still in search of a worthy foe. Meanwhile, in the Emperor of Mom's home office, a lonely and widespread desk mountain, a second great warrior sought the glory of battle, and his name was Paper. Even though he was the smartest warrior in all the land, he also was sad because no one could outwit him. He sent out across Desk Mountain to find his match. There he met a large square monster. I gobble up the likes of you and spit them out, little paper. Oh, then take my furry giant monster. Paper versus computer printer. Paper jam. Paper is victorious. Oh, that's Having beaten the fiercest fighter of Desk Mountain, Paper climbed down in the pit of office trash pin, where he battled the most terrifying horde of creatures in all the land. The hall, the half-eaten bag of trail mix. Dun, dun. Paper versus half bag eaten, half eaten bag of trail mix. Ah, foul wizard has blotted out the sun. Run for your lives, ladies. Paper wins again. Can no one beat me? And so, with a heavy heart, Paper departed the emperor, the empire of Mom's home office. At the same time in the kitchen realm, in the tiny village of Junk Drawer, there lived a third great warrior, and they called her Scissors. And she was the fastest blade in, of all the land. She too was unchallenged on this day. The first opponent was a strange and sticky circle man. Let us do battle, you tacky and vaguely round monstrosity. I will battle you, and I will leave you beaten and confused with massive adhesive and tangling powers. I don't 
I mean, turn, 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 turning the page. Scissors versus roll of tape. Scissors is victorious. Scissors forged on across the kitchen realm to the fridge waste of refrigerator freezer. There she met her most fearsome adversaries yet. Dinosaurs made of frozen breaded chicken. I have come from the far reaches of kitchen to battle you. A bizarre and yummy breaded dinosaur. Bow before our child, pleasing shape and flavor sword masters. No one can resist your crunchy awesomeness. Scissors versus dinosaur shaped chicken nuggets. Dinosaur shaped chicken nuggets win. No, wait. No, they don't. Scissors are victorious again. And am I so good that not even dinosaur-shaped chicken nuggets can yeah. beat me? And so scissors, like rock and paper before her, traveled beyond her own kingdom, seeking out a challenge, a challenger to her equal. Then one day, in the great cavern of the two-car garage, rock and scissors came face to face. I hope you're, oh, I'm sorry. If by, oh, sorry. I hope you're wearing your battle pants, rock warrior. If you, if by battle pants, you mean no pants, but I'm willing to fight you, then yes. Yes, I am wearing my battle pants, weird source scissory one. Rock versus scissors. An epic and legendary battle ensured, but ultimately, Rock was victorious. You have made me so happy by beating me. I wish I felt your joy, Scissors, for I have yet to meet a warrior who can beat me. Hi there. Those are fighting words. Wait, what? Rock versus paper. This is the best day of my life. Thank you for winning. Oh, great night of paper. That's fine for you, but it looks as though no one will ever beat me. Not so fast, paper. Wait, what? Scissors versus paper. You beat me. And the three great warriors hugged each other and danced for joy and they became fast friends. Finally, they had met, each met their matches. They were so happy, in fact, that they began the battle again. Round and round they win in the most massive and epic three-way battle of all times. And it is said that this joyous struggle still rages on to this very day. This is why children around the world in backyards, on playgrounds, and yes, even in classrooms, still honor the three great warriors by playing. Rock, paper, scissors. Hope you enjoyed that.